guys, I'm Lisa. And I'm Natasha. And we were wondering. Are you free for coffee? Welcome, welcome. <sighs> this is a jolly one. <laughs> yes. Okay, we're going to do Christmas flicks, y'all. So hopefully you'll get some uh, wrecks or, or, you know, discover some things that you hadn't thought of or hadn't seen to watch while you're on Christmas vacation. But, oh, which that's one too. Forgot about that one. Oh, Christmas vacation. <laughs> I did. But, okay, let's talk about the OGs. The old ones that we that we love are some of our favorites. So, my ultimate OG is the holiday. That is your you I never love made. that movie. And really, it's a it's a houses. But I love the story. I love the just the premise of it. It's just so sweet, and it it's just pro women. You know what mine you know? is? Home Alone. Oh yeah, that's, Which that's OG. Is it, that's it's OG. Christmas. It makes me think of my kids. Yeah, I can see because we were watching it. I love them. Well, and another now, I love Bridget Jones's Diary. Which, oh yeah, it's not a Christmas movie per se, but it's a lot of it is set around the holidays. Yeah, that it's hard. very snowy, yes. and it's a rom com. Yeah. So if you haven't seen them. There's three of them. Uh, Bridget Jones' Diary, I think there's part two, which has a name that I can't remember. And then Bridget Jones has a baby. Yes. And go ahead and watch all three of them because the fourth is coming out. You did tell me that. And I, I can't remember. Um, when we'll, get, we'll get back to you about when it's coming out and on what. It's streaming. Okay. So you'll be able to watch so you'll it. You'll be able to see it. So it's super cute. Just a cute rom-com. Um, Hugh Grant's in it, who we love. Yeah. It, and uh, so, anyway, th that's one. And another one I love that is not really a Christmas one per se is Little Women. You did tell and me. And it uh, it's snowy, and it, it there are some scenes of it around Christmas. Quite a bit of it revolves yeah. around Christmas. They come and go and back and forth. But both of those are kind of go women. <laughs> and <laughs> those, those are I love that. Like, Classic. Yes. Yeah, those are good. I'm and Little Women is so, if you have girls, that's a fun it's one a to watch one. with yeah, them. Any any addition. The one with Susan uh, Sarandon is really good, which is an older one. Winona Ryder, yeah, that that's a one. really good one. There's a more recent one uh, that Greta Gerwig did. I haven't seen that one yet. Oh, we went to the movies to see it. Did Me you? and my mom and who went? My daughter-in-law, my one daughter, Kennedy, book club. Kennedy. I figured it was Kennedy. Okay, that we, went, we all went, but it, like the day after Christmas, we went. And it, it is very sweet and snowy and Christmas and gets you in the mood. Okay. So do you have any other OGs that you like besides Home Alone? You're not going to like mine. No. It's going to be Die Hard and Long Kiss Goodnight. Okay. You know what I don't think I've ever, ever seen Long Who's in that? Long Kiss Goodnight. Um, Samuel L. Jackson, and I can see is it, it's a, What is it? Like a... You know, it's murder. Okay, yeah, no. So my mom does murder not do warm and fuzzy, y'all. My mom does not do warm and fuzzy. That's as Christmassy as she wanted to go. Now, she would do animated, right? Like, of course, we do Charlie Brown. We do The Grinch. We do those. Okay. But, which I'm okay with that. Okay. And my mom, my parents like the claymation. So, of course, we... Every, All like, of those. Frosty. Okay. And, yeah, those. Oh, Love Actually. That's a good OG one. That's it, that it is it set is around kinda, Christmas, okay, okay. but it's very rom com -y. It is. Another Hugh Grant. Um, there's a lot of people in that one. It's got so many storylines, but it's so adorable. You know another one? Elf. Elf has become oh, like yeah, a, that's a good, like a, that's an OG. OG it is. Yeah, it is. That's become, super cute. Um, you already said the Christmas vacation. Yeah. Which about. My sister-in-law, they have that on like, 24-7. Yes. I mean, it's like on the I don't think I had, oh, sorry, Chelsea. I don't think I had ever seen the whole thing, but we were at her house. And it just kept and going. It just kept going. And uh -huh. It's hilarious. It is funny. It's so funny. It is funny. But it, yeah. So I have a few from Netflix and a few from Hulu, but they're not. Okay. Now, you get, okay. These, are they current? Kind of like within the yes, last five years. years. Yep. Okay. What are those? Okay. So my Netflix one. Um, I have four for Netflix that I, I watch. Best Christmas Ever, Jingle Jangle. Best Christmas Ever. Were those the two gay guys? Was that it? Was it? Or no? Was that the name of that one? Oh, I got to look. 
best Christmas. I, gotta, I don't. I don't know. Okay, I'm just trying sorry. to remember. Okay, I'm just putting down I'm the sorry. Word. I feel no best Christmas ever was the one with Brandy. I don't want to give away what happened. Hey, you remember? Oh, yes, 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 yes. And so, guys, it's okay. Best this is Brandy. That's all you need to know. Christmas period ever. Okay, that was cute. Christmas. That was ever. cute. That, that was one cute. was cute. I think that was last year when we saw that, and that was good. Okay. Jingle jangle. Which, okay. Y'all know this. Like Forrest Whitaker greases my peach, y'all. So when that I was saw sweet. him, my, it, my it man was so good. Sugars like yes. That. Jingle that's jangle sweet. is really good. Yeah, that's very um, sweet. very upbeat. Not a sad one too much. Um, the holiday people of color too. Yes, which yes. The, those are few and far yes, between. They are. So yeah, with a happy story. And I had holiday too. That was you know, I love the holiday. That was cute. That's my little like. I don't feel good. I'm like holiday. And yes, I'm like, that's again. super sweet. And then love hard with my boy Jimmy. You oh, that's hard? why that was super cute. That was cute too. So those were my Netflix. Okay, I had a couple Netflix. Uh, Netflix. Okay. One was a uh, holiday in the vineyards. Which is a oh my gosh, that's right. With, um, what's her name? Was, Christina Milian? No, uh, that's not her. no, no. It's it's people I don't know. You've seen them, I'm sure, but we I don't know their this. names. They're not like we it's not super famous, but there's it's a cute one, and I believe there's two, might huh. be three. I think it's two in this in kind of a series, um, and a castle for Christmas, which is kind of very hallmark, that but it was on Netflix, so oh. and it's with Brooke Shields. Okay. So okay. I I love seeing um not twenty year olds. Yeah. You know, so yes. it's, it's kind of inclusive, age inclusive. Okay. So I that's a that. really sweet one. Come on, Netflix. Um, and Christmas in Notting Hill. That's so which cute. is a Hallmark one, but it's yes. it's very cute. I love Hallmark. Okay, so there's some some that we want to see. Now okay. these I have not seen. Let me which look. Ones? Um, there's a few guys. We watched. Well, this one. Oh no, this one I did see. It was on my two C list, and I just saw it. And it it's very cute. It's Christmas with the Sings. Oh, so it's a Indian family. What is this streaming on? Do you know? It's Hallmark. So okay. we probably okay. get it on Hulu, Hulu. or Peacock, or Peacock. Too. Yeah, okay. Um, okay. But it was really cute, and the guy that plays in it, you guys know him. I don't know his name, but he plays. He was in uh, Virgin River. He's in Hallmark. So he's in a lot of stuff, and he's cute, so you know him. So he's he's got the rom com leading man, oh, you know, look. Okay. But it was such a cute premise of the um, the cute guy falling in love with the Indian American nurse, and then they get together, they're engaged, and just kind of overcoming those family things. Yeah. You know, we we do this for Christmas, but my family does this, and it, and it was so cute. So that's a good that's one. Okay. Um, Christmas on call. I have not seen, but okay. it's on my list. Uh, Holiday touchdown, which is a chief's love story. So they hey. kind of did, I guess they got inspired by Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey. Holiday so, touchdown. so it's, it's set in Kansas city, I guess okay. and around the chiefs. So a football couple, okay. I don't know. The fact that you want to watch this, well, do I it thought, for me, y'all. Well, well, no, no, I can't get loose and watch nothing with sports. Yeah, so it's okay. in Kansas City. I'm going to let count. So if you're a football fan, play a rom com, there you go. I'm going to add this to my list. Yeah. Okay. But the scenes is super cute. Because okay. you never, or rarely, let me, I won't say never, but rarely do you see people of other ethnicities and other. Now this was interesting too, because he asked her, Oh, I thought you were Hindu. She said, no, my family is Christian, but yeah, my it's, mom's it's the family yeah. is Hindu. And I mean, that was interesting. Okay, okay. This, it, it was super cute. And it looks super Hallmark y'all. Okay. I'm, I ain't ragging on Hallmark. Cause I love, if you, if, we oh, we if you're feeling some kind of way, Just turn on and nothing better yeah. than chicken soup and a Hallmark movie yeah, to I make you feel better. So I'm I not, do. I am not getting on Hallmark. But Hallmark has stepped up their they game. Have, maybe. They they have better actors. Their sets are like their sets are gorgeous. The houses are different. They're yeah. very, they're very we, used to, we used to watch, watch a same, different story in the same, same house. farmhouse. Yes. You know what I mean? <laughs> they just changed from the, I've seen this before. Yes. Yeah. So now they just the, everything is different. The actors are better. It's Hallmark has really done a phenomenal job the last couple Leveling of years. Up. They, have. they really have. I agree. So okay, okay. let's see. You have Hulu's? Um, well, those are that's all that's my list. list. So I have a Hulu list too. So if you if you have Netflix subscription, I gave you some. So my Hulu list is these are current ones. 
Or, or yeah, these are all kind of current. These current. are not OGs. Okay. These okay. are like in the last like five, six years. Okay, okay. As, you know, if not last year or two. Christmas with the Cranks. Okay. I love that. Yeah. Um, Santa Games, which is so... Okay, wait, let me fun. see. Wait, you know OG Who's we didn't that? mention that's not family friendly, but like if you're doing like a little grown up, you know, eggnog situation, Bad Santa. Oh, when the kids are in bed. Yeah. Bad that's Santa, so funny. But Bad Santa is not. This it's is not for your not kids for, no. at all. It's grown Maybe folks Bob only. Is a fool. Um, Santa Games. He's a comedian. I'm trying to look because I... I can see Santa his face. Games. Yeah, and it's, it's on Hulu. It's on now. Hulu. Okay. So you should watch it. I don't know that I've seen it. I mean, that's one. obviously not one to watch with Littles, but it is good. Okay. Um, you know his. I'm looking at him. Guys, I have to show her because now it's going to drive me crazy. It's going to pop up. Jingle All the Way. You okay. Know yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Save on Love. Come on. Okay. I, like, I, I haven't seen that one. Okay. But that, that one's funny. Um, so Christmas with the Crank, Santa Games. Jingle all the way, okay, and the Santa stakeout. The Santa stakeout is that cute. one either. Okay, Natasha, she sees the actiony, funny ones. Which are those? That's not yeah, really what I'm drawn know, my to. Mama usually, don't believe in. Yeah, she likes she'll mayhem believe in and madness. My mom, Christmas. if no one gets shot, she's like, "Why are we watching?" <laughs> I'm like, mom, it's I need somebody's guts hanging out. Literally, that so I can say you know what? It's like Game of Thrones had a Christmas episode. <laughs> that would be my like, jam. She'd be yeah. like, now this is good Christmas. I'm like, mom, the kids are crying. And she's like, I love it. So yeah, guys, I can't do just regular, but I do love Bad Santa. Yeah, but if I had cute. kids, I used to watch. That was my thing. Okay. I would make Mexican hot chocolate. You know, I always make hot chocolate from scratch. So like, I'm, I'm spending some time. I would pour it up. Loaded with my marshmallows because I was really half marshmallows, half cocoa, and I would watch Bad Santa. I have to watch it different now, guys, strokes for different folks, which, which is why we have a list so you can pick, you can pick what, what you, you like. want to see warm and fuzzy or madness and mayhem. Just saying, okay. What is your quote? My quote is I radiate good health from the inside out, and yours is so good. Okay. Which has nothing to do with Christmas. Day. It doesn't, but then it okay. is it is a warm and fuzzy. Yes. And we need to think healthy thoughts during this kind of Time. cold flu COVID yes, season. season. Just saying. So I guess ours are like our movies. Yours is warm and fuzzy, and mine is be merry, be bright. Doesn't that sound like something no. Samuel no. Jackson says before he shoots somebody? <laughs> be merry, be bright. No. It's like it's a good one. So yeah, no. That's a t shirt. I think I have a pillow, merry and bright. You do. You do. Yeah, it's a pillow. Yeah, you can have it somewhere else. Collection of pillows. Yeah, they're like stuffed animals. It like really stuffed it animals. is. She has at least fifty. But but thank I, you for pulling up a chair and joining us for coffee. Please subscribe to Are You Free for Coffee podcast wherever you are listening. We hope that you enjoyed today's episode. Got a few holiday recommendations and find joy in the little things. Until next time. Thanks, guys. Mm -hmm.